Hey guys, I just wanted to pop in um, before this week of my life vlog. It is like more of a like quote unquote normal vlog, but um, if you guys are not aware, I don't know how you would not be aware of what's going on with George Floyd and just the terrible, like disgusting racism that uh, has been occurring in our country and the lives that have been lost. Um, it is just literally like awful and heartbreaking um this video was filmed like as things are happening and then like i kind of i talked about it a little bit and stuff um because dom like my best friend dom's graphics are like everywhere so i'm gonna have her instagram linked down below to follow and it's just like awful um i'm gonna have her instagram linked down below as well as petitions that you guys can sign um and places to like donate to you guys have other like good places to donate to and stuff that um i don't have linked down below like definitely let me know um also dom's instagram honestly is like the number one tool because there's a lot of things um i talk about it actually in the vlog after this too but um this was filmed this video in particular was filmed like a, before a little bit anyways i would follow her instagram because there's a lot of practical things you can do a lot of like it's very educational you'll learn a lot um but yeah i just i'm with you guys i see you like i'm i'm so sorry so with that being said we're gonna get into the vlog and i kind of just talk about like it's it is so crazy too just on the topic too of like I think what Dom has done and what Dom is doing is like so incredible and it also just shows like the power of a voice and it's just so cool and like if anything it just shows like your influence and your words matter. So anyways, obviously this is was murder, this is racism, people should not be losing their lives because of the color of their skin. Like it's absolutely insane. So anyways, we're gonna get into the vlog. Um, I just, it felt weird not addressing it and I talk about it again in like my next vlog a little bit, but it's just so important. Like this isn't something that I'm just gonna like stop talking about or that I think anyone should just stop talking about um, until there's like justice and equality and everything. So I love you guys. I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. Um, I don't even remember at what point this was filmed and then this stuff happens and stuff. So just like keep that in mind. Um, but yeah. Anyways, I'll have stuff linked down below. Donate if you guys can donate. If you can't donate, educate yourself. Share things on social media. Um, we can watch like documentaries, read books. Like there's so many things that you guys can be doing. Follow Dom's Instagram because she's constantly posting um, even more helpful things. So like there's gonna be more stuff from the time that this I say this and then she's gonna post more. Do you see what I'm saying by the time this video goes up? Okay, I love you guys. Let's get into the vlog. Oh, oh. Yep, welcome to another week of my life, guys. I'm gonna turn this fan off, because it looks awful. Hey guys, good morning. It is Tuesday, so it's the start of the week, because it's a holiday week. Um, it's 11, I had a really slow morning. I'm just now about to go run, and I'm actually gonna go run at my dad's, because um, I'm catching up right now. I missed like a run last week, so I have to finish today. And then we start our new runs tomorrow, like me and Alyssa. Um, it's week two, day three. For those of you who care, we're using the Couch 25K app. Not 25k to 5k. Why do I always say 25k? Not that ambitious, okay? Anyway, so it's like 11 and um, I just had a slow morning. I probably woke up at like 10. Like I was so tired. I actually stayed up. I don't want to grab my Kindle right now, but I stayed up really late. Um, I started Outer Banks last night, if you guys watched the Weekend of My Life vlog. And then uh, I got like a few episodes in. I'm actually thinking I'm going to like watch shows now that I have this den. And then I um, finished reading One Day in December, if you guys are ever interested in my book reads and stuff. Um, they're always on my book highlight on Instagram. You can follow my Goodreads, but like I only say like what I've read on my Goodreads to like keep track of it for myself. Um, and I don't personally review on Goodreads, but I read reviews on Goodreads, you know what I mean? And I'm gonna go run on the treadmill so I can drop my clothes off at my dad's house because my washer and dryer don't get here for like two more weeks, I think. My outfit. Wearing Lulu leggings. These are lines. I know I'm not supposed to work out in these, but I, I just need to put them on because they're the most comfortable leggings ever. Like, you don't really work out in these, really. They are just, like, literally the softest things you'll ever put on your body, guys. If you don't have a pair of line leggings, you need them. I'll link them down below. Thank you later. This white sports bra is from... Fabletics, it's the Mila collection. I would have never worn anything white before, especially when I'm, like, gonna sweat, but, um... Now that I've been using Savon Ayla's like Lux Unfiltered Self Tanner and it literally does not like, and it literally does not transfer to your clothes at all. You're so good to go. I feel confident to wear it. Um, also, oh, my like in my life vlog, I already showed these, but Allbirds sent me running shoes. So now I have actual running shoes. And I, I really like these. I actually think most running shoes are ugly, but I like these, so. Anyways, I'm gonna put these on, make some breakfast. I normally don't eat before, but like I'm starting my day so late that I'm so hungry now. Um, 
and then we're gonna keep going on this run. But I thought I was gonna be at the lake for the next few days, so my schedule here is not like crazy intense right now. If anyone else does this, this is probably not relatable at all because you'd have to like work for yourself, but I have like weeks where I will go crazy and I work so much. And then I'll have weeks where I'm like a little bit more relaxed, but I think I'm just like more of the average person. It really just like depends, but I kind of have like alternated those a little bit in quarantine. This intro is so long, everyone. I'm so sorry. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, I'm gonna shut up. If you're new here, subscribe. My merch is available. I keep forgetting to say that on vlogs. Like literally cannot stop forgetting that. Um, the hot merch in all of the like IOS and collegiate stuff, all available on Amazon. I just wanted to show you guys an actual view of my outfit. Fabletics. Not Forever 21, Lululemon, Align Leggings. Everyone needs them, guys. And then my uh, Allbirds running shoes. I feel so official with my running shoes. Isn't that exciting? Okay, well, I'm gonna go downstairs. I decided a banana and a kind bar because I wanna make my yogurt when I get home, and that's just an experience, you know? Did you forget when I tried to sit it down and talk it to Okay, I'm back in the gym, um, aka my father's house. Gonna run. I put my laundry in the machine. I just have no energy right now, guys. I'm debating even stopping at Starbucks after to get a cold brew, but like, I, it's just kind of unnecessary. <laughs> so, all right, guys, I just finished my run, feeling amazing. Um, it actually has gotten so much easier. Like, this is just my sixth run on our plan, I think, right? We start week three tomorrow, um, and I already feel like so much better. It was incredible. Love this app. I'm um, listening to the morning toast. They're talking about call her daddy and all that stuff. I just want to quickly say I don't think Sophia is as greedy as everyone makes her out to be. I am not a call her daddy person. I'm not a call her daddy person. I've never listened. But just from the business standpoint and knowing how podcasts work, typically you have a percentage, which would be like 70%, and that's what you have of the entire podcast. I don't want to get into this because I don't want to be a part of this, but like what she was asking for was not crazy. Like, I don't think what she was asking for was crazy because that is really just standard like I think Barstool runs their stuff totally different than everyone else does but like if they were with someone else they would probably be making like 70% of what they normally make just from like someone who's in the industry and understands what they're saying just please know that it actually wasn't that crazy and um, I respect how much Alex loves the show and is staying there and like I probably would have taken the deal and just stayed for a year and then left to the IP but it's like they were really, really severely taken advantage of. And like, obviously a $500,000 deal to anyone sounds like a lot because it is so much money. But when your podcast is making 5.2 million annually on ads alone and you're editing it, like that's absolutely crazy. I get a high percentage of my podcast with production included. So I make a high percentage of every profit and they still edit it. So, um, that's all I'm going to say, but just like, please, I just don't think that I just don't think that like what it's made out to be is like really fully true like if you're in the industry you understand that like it wasn't really outlandish but also like they went into this having no idea so like you're going to get screwed out of contracts i've signed contracts that i didn't understand and like gotten way less than what i deserved on things so like i get it um but just like so we stopped bullying sophia like it's not actually like crazy what she was asking for at all so, so it's one and i'm actually just now making my breakfast um today's a very chill slow day i'm finishing the morning toast but um made myself a glass of water i'm actually gonna roast some chicken and i'm gonna prep for the hollywood bowl um for lunch because you know it's already lunchtime. but i need to prep the chicken i haven't like seasoned it or anything like that so don't flame me in the comments while that's in the oven, I'm going to go do all the work that I need to do in my office so then I can just take it all down to the den. But I need to like record a podcast intro and a few things as well. Um, and then I can go and take everything down to the den and I'm so excited. Hello, hello, hello. Testing, testing, testing. Coco, you don't need the Windex. Thank you. All right, everyone. I finished. Oh, wait, I have four minutes left of the chicken. We finished. The podcast intros and outros for this week. My hair is wild. I'm out of my super goop super glow sunscreen and I ordered refills on it like literally a month or two ago on Sephora and I'm still waiting for that package. Sephora shipping is like really backed up right now and I hope it comes this week because I'm out of it and I literally cannot live without it. It's my favorite products I've ever used. So anyways, I'm going to finish eating my, my little breakfast and then I'm going to go down to prep my salad everyone for the week. So 
I'm just gonna cut everything up, put it in little boxes, and then it'll just be easier when I make my salad throughout the day. I'm really excited about it. Okay, guys, I just cut all of these grapes in half and put them in here. It just tastes better in salads when they're cut in half, I promise you. But um, I didn't know what to do with the rest of the grapes, and then I was like, oh my gosh, I forgot about this. Did any of you guys grow up with like your mom freezing grapes? Like this is like one of the, our like signature road trip snacks was to just put a bunch of grapes in a bag and then have them freeze. And they're like such a good like little, almost like dessert. Like they're just so good. It's a really great snack. So that's what I'm doing with the remainder of my grapes. Very excited about it. Um, and then I'll just put it in the freezer. But it just really, really took me back to family road trips when I was like, seven you know just been over there editing but the chicken's done i cut it up i have my grapes cut in half very important and then my jicama um the rest of it it's like raisins and just random things that are already put like together so i'm gonna put this in the fridge and then obviously i'll just do like the kale whenever i actually like make the salad and stuff but this will just make it a lot faster the other stuff's already sectioned off it's 2.30. Um, I normally honestly drink coffee in the afternoons now. Um, anyways, I'm gonna go head downstairs, create my work vibe in the den, my cozy day slash editing on my laptop day. It's gonna be great. Guys, I'm finally downstairs. This is what I've been waiting for all day, but like why would I ever wanna leave? And my rug and everything is coming in this week now. So like all of this is gonna be even cozier. Oh my gosh, it's just so cute. Time literally does not exist in here. Um, it's 10 p.m. I actually got a lot of work done while I was in here. I'm like pretty impressed. I just FaceTimed some friends, caught up, watched some stuff, you know, whatever. I'm gonna go upstairs, get a new book, go to bed. So I'll see you guys hey in the everyone. It is Wednesday. I'm about to go work out. I'm wearing a set active uh, sports bra and then I almost said Melissa would help leggings. My Lululemon leggings. Um, I wear Lulu leggings like pretty much every day. And then I'm going to go downstairs and do a little Melissa Wood Health workout. Last night I started reading It Ends With Us with Colleen Hoover and it was so good, guys. Like from the second, probably one of the best books I've read in a long time. Like from the second I started the book, I was hooked and I'm currently 55% of the way down. But like I cannot even express to you how good this book has been and I stayed up so late last night to watch it and I'm just to watch it, to read it. And I'm just so excited to read again today because it was just that good. Like I would have honestly stayed up last night until it was already like two or three when I went to bed until like five or six to finish the book if it wouldn't have ruined today. Um, but it's just so good. My neck right now, well, okay. My, my neck right now legit looks like a reptile and then my chest is messed up. My chest is messed up, not from um, self tanner, but from like peeling and then I've, I mean I guess self tanner but it's just I got sunburned basically um I need a little snack before I do this workout it was all the wrong setting that's why it looked weird okay anyways my neck looks like a reptile this is like peeling I'm not gonna like show you guys my boobs but lots been going on okay guys I was in the middle of my workout and then I moved everything so basically this is here and eventually if I want a treadmill it would be great because obviously you can just go over this mat I can just roll this up and then do it wherever I want I don't know but I was trying to play Melissa Wood Health. Oh, you know what? That light affects it more. Um, I mean, it's not really on right now. But originally, this was the layout that I wanted for the garage. And then the rest of the stuff will be here. Um, but I just felt like this couch was too big. And then I was like, you know what? No, because I am so screwed as far as like the projector goes. But now that's perfect for the projector. So we're going to keep that. And then it's perfect as well for my workouts. Um, all these cords are so ugly, but, um, I just, I actually got one that's, like, not colored. That's gonna be here, um, very soon. I think, actually, it's a star rug yesterday. I don't know where it is, but, um, I can run it through, like, underneath the rug as well when the rug gets here and then go around and then, like, that'll probably just stay there. I did get a little, um, Amazon, like, I just ordered it two seconds ago, a projector stand, but honestly, like, that's perfect, and the projector stand was like $50, and I feel like that might just be more convenient to have, so I think I'm going to cancel my order. Um, but it just flows better this way, and then I want to do some photos there or something. I don't know, but this ended up working out well. Coco, you've got to chill, girl. Why? There's this bar that my dad has at his house in the suburbs, and he keeps saying he wants to give it to me. I don't really drink enough to have a bar, Coco, chill, but it would be a really cool vibe for here, but I just don't think it works, so... We'll see. I mean, I guess I could push this back and then put it in the corner. Because it would be cool for entertaining, you know what I mean? But 
All right, I don't know why you do this. I have my ball at Bingo's on. I was literally in the middle of the workout. Okay, so I did a nice little light Melissa Wood Health workout. Um, it wouldn't even let me log in to my thing today. I don't know why on the app. So I actually just did stuff off of her Instagram and then I'll figure out why my password wasn't working. But um, I like this setup better and it's gonna be great when everything is here. So I'm excited. Anyway, so I just did a light workout because today was like technically my day off anyways. I just wanted to like move a little bit this morning. Um, and I need to like go and get ready. I cannot keep doing this like not waking up early thing. It's driving me insane, but like I literally cannot sleep before like 2 or 3 a.m. It's so bad. It is time for... Guys, I don't actually feed Coco this. I just like am so lazy. I haven't taken this out to the trash, but I just don't have enough room in my trash can anyways ever. Okay, here is my beautiful Hustle Matcha Energy. I've only had one, but I already love them so much. So this is what I'm going to have this morning. Um, lately, coffee has just been sounding really heavy to me. I don't know why. I go through my phases. All right, guys. So I finished filming my video. I think I literally talked for an hour. I have so many things that I was like so excited to share with you guys, I guess. But oh my gosh, we talked so long. Um, update. I just like don't like my office right now. Like I got to I mean, it's just such a mess and I like don't even really work in here. I've just got to redo it. I'm going to move this rug downstairs to the den. I feel like it's just more of the den vibe, but... I just like don't know what I want. I think if I put stuff on the walls, I don't know. Also, it's the fact that I don't have that much natural lighting in here, I think is really killing me. But I've got to figure something out. So the frame for the Dolly Parton print comes today. I don't even know where that's going. This will be my next project, I think, in just figuring out what I like and stuff. But like, I don't know, guys. I just don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So we will see. Anyways, I'm gonna go work downstairs. Okay, Uncut Gems, guys, if anyone has seen this movie, it was literally, it actually, no movie has given me anxiety like that. I saw it on Christmas, and it was just insane. Um, anyways, I have been in such a Taylor Swift vibe lately, not because of a breakup, but because I don't know why, it just is so nostalgic for me, and so, like, everyone's going through the, like, nostalgic quarantine whatever, and I just, I mean, I love Taylor Swift, I'm not gonna lie, like, I'm a big fan. Um, so I just keep putting Reputation on in the background. I don't relate to any of this. I'm in a very good place. Um, it's not because of that. That's why I ref like I refrain from posting about this because I feel like people are just gonna be like, oh, but it's like genuinely it isn't. I just love Taylor Swift. So that is what we're doing. We're putting this on. I'm making my salad and we're getting to work. Currently editing a TikTok and getting a bunch of work done. I have until about six and I need to start cooking. I have my, um, my slow cooker is arriving. I actually think, um, soon. So I'll start kind of on that within the next few hours. I'm just gonna knock out some work for the next probably four hours. I have my beautiful Hollywood Bowl salad that looks so good. Oh my gosh. The last thing I'm gonna put out, you can scrub it, you can leave. It's amazing. Like, oh, they're literally all from Amazon. Um, the first thing would be these sunglasses. Hi guys, okay, I just got so many packages. I, I had to take multiple trips up the stairs and now I'm out of breath, you guys know the drill. <sighs> guys, I work out all the time and I'm still out of breath with these stairs and like I just don't know what's wrong with me. Let's pretend this isn't here, okay? Sephora package finally came, I've been waiting on this stuff for like a month. Their shipping is super backed up, so if you can buy things anywhere else, I'd recommend it, but at the same time, like, you know, we're in a pandemic, so. First thing, I got a replacement for my all-time favorite lip balm, the Summer Fridays Old School YouTube. Um, what is it called? Lip Butter Balm. I am obsessed with lip balm. I'm always applying lip balm. I don't know. I literally hate my hair right now. I am obsessed with lip balm. I'm always applying lip balm, and this is my favorite lip product I've ever used in my entire life. It smells amazing. And it is so moisturizing. So I will literally probably always have one of those. I like that so much more than I liked my Laneige, which I used to be obsessed with. I've gone through a lot that I've really loved, but that is by far the best. Guys, I ran out of glow screen, so my skin has just not been as good the past like two days. So I purchased another one, like literally a month before I was even close to running out because this is my all-time holy grail product. And I just ran out and finally arrived. So I'm really excited. I also got the Way Detox Shampoo. I get product buildup really easily in my hair. So I really needed a good detox shampoo. I normally don't spend much on it, but it is something that I really need. So I decided to get this from Way. I love Way. Um, I actually have another thing. They're now on Amazon. So if you guys wanted to come way quicker, I would buy um, anything way on Amazon. I have legit 
one, two, I have like six or seven packages from Amazon right now. My extension cord for downstairs. I got some random cleaner stuff that you guys don't care about. I have an Outdoor Voices package. They sent me some more clothes. I literally live in Outdoor Voices. Um, I really wanted the exercise dress, so I think that's what this is. The first thing I have is a sports bra. With as much as I wear Outdoor Voices, I've actually never owned a sports bra from them. So I'm excited about this. Next thing I have, I have this cute skirt. I really wanted in black, but they're out of the black. But I just think that these skirts are so cute. It's the exercise skirt. Guys, I have like some weird speech impediment today. I can't talk. Not weird, but like weird as in like out of the blue. I have one. Does that make sense? I'm really excited for this. I just think this is like a really cute like everyday summer outfit with like sneakers, white t-shirts, some cute jewelry, hair up, claw camp. You know what I mean? So I love this and I also really, really want it in black. I'll have it linked down below. Here we go. I finally have the exercise dress. Um, it's so cute. I believe it's a score. Yeah, it's a score underneath, but it's like this super, super cute, just black dress. I love this just for everyday wear. Um, maybe I'll become a tennis star this summer. I'm actually really considering it, but I just think it's super cute. And obviously there's a score and it's really light, so it's perfect again for Texas summers. How many times can I say that in videos, you know? I'm just really preparing myself for the worst this summer, guys. It is hot, okay? Next thing, I got another Whey product, but I got this one from Amazon and it came in two days. The other stuff came in a month. So, um, Whey is now like certified as a seller on Amazon and they sell like actually directly through Amazon. Um, but I got a treatment mask because I feel like my hair has just been so dry and like weird lately. So I wanted to try this and see and the reviews are really, really good. So I will keep you guys posted. I think this is from an Instagram shop. Oh my gosh, so cute. Thank you so much. It's custom XGG. And they're also sending me a custom tea coming soon, which is cute. But I love how this is just oversized neutral. You guys know me and my oversized neutral crews. This is so cute. So I love it. I might actually even like throw this on later. Um, but thank you so much. It's so sweet. We still have two more packages guys I had to get new baking sheets because I ruined mine yesterday and I needed more anyway So we have three got these on Amazon now you guys are on the last box. So one sec. I got this crock pot guys This is so Exciting. Oh my gosh. I can do so many slow cooker recipes, which is what I'm gonna do today I have two ready. I have two recipes that I plan to make with this this week, but I am so excited. I got the six quart. I just like, oh my gosh, guys, I'm so freaking excited. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so awesome. And it makes your house smell so good. I feel like the real deal now. This is what I'm making today. Very, very excited. Updates to come, everyone. That just looks incredible. Total time, three hours, 40 minutes. I really just feel like, a, I feel like superwoman at this point, seriously. I haven't even made it yet. What if it's awful, you know? Who knows? It's okay. Okay, everyone, there's been a change. I am actually gonna make this like lasagna soup because they gave me, I don't know how I didn't realize this when I, oh my gosh, it looks like I'm like pregnant. Um, I don't know how I didn't realize this, but they gave me ground beef and not, and not like a chuck roast, which is what I need. So I'm gonna need to go to the grocery store before I actually make that, um, which is fine. It's not that big of a deal. I was just so looking forward to making this today. So now I'm making something else. And then I'll just make the other thing later. So that's the plan. Wow. Okay, I don't know why my music is turned off. Um, but it is 5:13. I am done. I'm done with my work for today. Um, Sid is coming over at six, so I'm gonna start cooking us dinner. We're actually, like I said, making lasagna soup. So I'm gonna make an entire TikTok of it. I'm not gonna like vlog it. Um, if you guys are ever wondering how I make certain things, legit, every single recipe as of right now that I've shared online besides bolognese and pasta salad, I'm gonna say, for the most part, are on my TikTok. So always look there, um, but I'm gonna edit those and put those on there as well, I just haven't done it yet. It's kind of feeling like a nice glass of wine. So this is like half, this is all I have left of this glass. It looks like it's so, it looks like it's actually, no, it doesn't look full at all. I only have like half a glass left of this wine. So here we are, people. <laughs> I accidentally put 19 uh, hours and I meant to put 20 minutes. So here we are. Um, anyways, just made lasagna soup. Sid is here. Looks really incredible. Just really, as always, extremely impressed, you know? 
Wow, Sydney just moved hers over. Oh, yours looks better than mine right now. You really mixed that up. Yeah. Wow. Looks amazing. Wait, okay, Sid said it tastes amazing, but I, I uh, it like uh, no, she's lying. She said it tastes amazing and I accidentally stopped recording and now she won't say it again. Oh. So just left, we ate dinner and then we watched Newlyweds in um, the den and it was so funny. Like, what a throwback. I literally had a dream that Nick Lachey asked me for my number the other night. Don't ask why, I literally have no idea. Um, so random, but what a blast from the past. Seriously, turning off all my lights, I'm gonna go upstairs. I cannot wait to read my book. I'm hoping to finish it tonight. It's literally the best book I think I've ever read. I'm so excited. Guys, this is just the best vibe ever. Like, it's almost nine. I'm getting into bed to read for probably the next two, three hours. I'm at 55% of the way through of like my favorite book. This is, I actually think it is just my favorite book now, guys. Morning, so everyone, it's 8.30. I don't like my workout outfit, but I'm just working out from home, so it doesn't matter. I am wearing um, the Outdoor Voices sports bra they sent me. It's nice because it's like basically a top. Um, propeller hat. Okay, anyways. I'm gonna go downstairs and do a Melissa Wood health workout. It's 8.30. I've made myself wake up at 8, which is great. Um, I am emotionally torn from the book I finished last night. Oh my gosh, it ends with us calling Hooper. It's the best book I've ever read, I think, genuinely. Like, oh my gosh. I just can't stop thinking about it. I dreamed about it. It was just really something. Like, really, really something. So, anyways, we're gonna go downstairs and go work out. <sighs> okay, I just finished my workout. It was incredible. Melissa would help on the big screen. Um, right here, I use Bala bangles, but I'm actually about to go upstairs, shower, get ready for the day. Okay, I just changed, showered, all of that stuff. Um, oh my gosh, okay, we're turning this off. Nope, wrong one. I'm wearing my exercise dress from Atro Voices. It's so comfortable and light. Oh my gosh. Anyways, I have therapy in like 40 minutes. I'm going back to therapy, guys. Good news. Hi. It's honestly not for like any particular reason. I've been trying to go back to therapy for like, I kid you not, two years. And then when I got back to Dallas, I was like, okay, I'm gonna go for sure. So since like... February? When did I move here? February? I've been looking for someone and then I finally found someone that I liked and then did all the stuff, whatever. I finally found someone and it's my first appointment today. I've had this in the books for like a while. I promise it's not for any like particular reason. But, I mean, I like grew up in therapy so this is not new to me but I hope that I really like my new therapist and it's great. I literally look like a housewife and I'm off to therapy and I'm literally like I'm going to tennis practice. So, you know. Here's a better look. Honestly, 10 out of 10 recommend the exercise dress from After Voices. It's so cute. There's shorts underneath. It's so cute. There's shorts underneath. I wish I had a little bit longer of socks to wear with this, but I couldn't find any. So I'm really excited. It's so light. Like this is literally the perfect outfit. You can do anything in it. It's so comfy. Wow. Look at this just beautiful color palette we have going here. Just made a vanilla latte because I really need coffee. This is one of my first things that I'm going and doing in uh, two months. So, I have my mask, social Dallas mask. Cute look, right? Not wearing that in the car. Um, just throwing that in my bag, with my latte, and we're off. Oh my gosh, guys, one, it is hot. I am so glad. I did that, like unbelievably glad. I think I obviously got emotional in there, but I have like been in and out of therapy. I don't know why my camera settings are just always off. Whew. I was in and out of therapy growing up um, and I just always needed to go back. Honestly, this is like dealing with childhood things. It's nothing recent, but like I literally already feel so good in like, I just, I mean, like, obviously it was hard and I, like, cried a bunch, but, like, I'm so glad I did that. Like, I can't even describe to you how glad I am that I did that. <sighs> Thursday therapy. Okay, guys, that's what we're doing now. Also, I get a lot of questions about this, and I had a lot of questions about this, so I, personally, for me, it was just really important to have a Christian therapist. Um, she doesn't even, like, and they're not, like, oh, my gosh, pray about it. Like, that's not what happens. Honestly, my therapist didn't even, like, bring it up at all but um just that basis because that's like how i live my life so it would make sense to like have a therapist that like can you know kind of counsel me in that um but anyways so and i've gone to like non-christian therapists and it's like totally great regardless but for me that's what i really wanted i have really good health insurance because both my dad and my stepmom are in the medical field so 
Guys, I'm so sorry, it's so hot. But anyways, I found someone finally from recommendations and then normally my um, insurance would like cover pretty much everything, but with this, it only covers up to 60% of out-of-network. It's really hard to find in-network Christian therapists, so I'm just paying, it's worth it 100%. It is so worth it, I don't care. So, what an investment, you know? Anyways, I'm really glad I did that. Literally so glad I did that, guys. All right, guys, home from lunch, reheating some stuff. Triplets are here. Did Seth just go hide? That's shocking. He loves the camera. He'll come back, guys. My chairs have arrived. They are a totally different color than I was told on the website. Um, they're supposed to take like a week to take form totally, but they're fine. I mean, I don't really care that much about, like it, it, I actually still like them. It's totally okay. I need all of this to go. Um, Seth's taking trash out and so is Abby, but we're working on this. Ryan is gonna be the, um, Handyman? Table builder? Yeah, table builder today. Turbo mode, eight minutes, which is probably gonna take us like 25, but it's fine, we're fine. So exciting, package from Mush. Guys, I seriously look like a tennis mom right now. Um, we were outside, so the triplets are my step siblings. If you don't know, I actually have like seven siblings. So um, if you need me to do a family tree, I'll do it. But anyways, they just come over for lunch and we wanted to hang out and then they were so nice because I had stuff to do. So they were just like helping me unbox stuff and my pool upstairs, guys. I know that no one's surprised, but it was disgusting. So we had to dump that out and then kind of clean off the rooftop, which we did. It's 3 p.m. now. I was gonna go on a walk with my dad, but I think he's still working. So anyways, I need to get stuff done. I'm recording with some girls at five. Then we have a Bible study tonight um, and all that stuff. But I have some new stuff for the house. My new TV got here. Um, a new frame, the Dolly Parton thing, you know, whatever. I've been editing TikToks for the past like 30 minutes. It's so quick to edit them. Um, so I posted one, I have some ready and I'm gonna film a few more. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go get the rest of the packages and then we're just gonna do some errands and stuff today. Not errands, um, just like random to-dos that I need to do. All right guys, so obviously with everything that's like going on, it's literally disgusting and horrible. Um, Dom made these graphics, so if you guys, and she made an entire post, like we posted this whole thing on my page, and then as well as hers, it's so crazy because this is like actually Dom's graphic, guys, the one that's going everywhere, like Reese Witherspoon just posted it, so it's just like justice for George Floyd, it's literally awful, but there's a post, all these practical ways and things that you guys can do to help, especially on Dom's page, she has so many things that are like, she has IGTVs on how to help and all of this like things like things that you can watch and just so many practical ways that you can help and it's really awesome. So check that out. Okay guys, I got a new TV because for some reason that one stopped working and I just needed a new TV in here. Um, who knows if I'll really watch it at night. I feel like I'll put it on when I'm getting ready. Um, and this is the built-in fire TV, which I have fi a fire stick, so it's just easier that it's all together. So I'm gonna set this up right here where the other one is. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this one. It just like randomly went out, but it was super cheap anyways. This is also really exp inexpensive. It was like $100, so I'll have it linked down below. Okay, we set it up. Very exciting. Um, these prints I got replaced, and they're coming soon. This speaker doesn't normally go there, and I have some accessories. I need to get a plant there, but this is great. Okay guys, honestly, not feeling too hot. It's like 5 p.m. Um, I've been working a little bit and just doing emails and stuff, but, and editing TikToks as always. Um, but I just like don't really feel great. I think I'm gonna go shower and maybe I'll, that'll help. I don't really know. I was gonna do a recording at five. I always think there's someone else in my house. Um, I had a recording at five and that got pushed back, which is totally fine. So I'm gonna go shower, do some stuff, hopefully feel better. And then uh, we have Zoom Bible study tonight, so. I need to get that all taken care of. I just like don't feel good. I just like keep getting these headaches in the afternoon and I think that they're like caffeine headaches that maybe I'm not drinking enough water. So I've been drinking water and yeah, I don't feel like actually sick. It's just like a headache type thing, you know? All right guys, so I just took a nice bath, jets and all. Um, but I mentioned earlier in this vlog how my hair has been so dry and I got these new products to try it out. Um, I've had the Way hair oil for forever. Honestly, when I used it in LA, I liked it better than I even do now, but I still love it. My stepsister also got it for her birthday and was like, this is the best thing ever. So it is a really great hair oil. I just don't know what's up with the texture of my hair. Anyways, I got this detox shampoo and then I did a treatment mask. So I just left this in for 10 minutes and I read from my Kindle. Um, and yeah, so 
my hair feels softer like wet so i guess that's not really like a good way to show i guess i'll figure it out whenever it's dry and see how it feels but i'll let you guys know because it already feels better now so i'm really hoping that this is like a miracle product okay i haven't mixed my salad yet but i just feel so lightheaded which is crazy because i ate so much I'm, I just don't know why I just feel off today, but um, anyways, I'm gonna have one of these as like my dessert, my mush, I love them, my step-siblings were obsessed with them. Have my salad, the chicken and stuff's underneath, and then I just poured another big glass of water and watching Brooke on the TV. Okay guys, still not feeling my best, but I just ate and drank like three glasses of water. I'm gonna kind of chill, um, do some reading for tonight's Bible study. I've already done the reading, but I just wanna reread and kind of chill relax and i'm gonna do it it's just a zoom call um any of you guys are welcome by the way it's always weekly we've been this is our first week of doing thursdays but yeah it's weekly you just join our facebook group hi coco okay guys i'm done with bible study it was great i'm gonna go upstairs and read here we go again guys yet another night of reading my favorite kind of nights this is why i like quarantine because i can be in bed every night at 8 p.m to read <sighs> good morning guys it's friday um it is 7 50 i woke up at 7 30 who's proud i can't believe it's already friday oh it was a four-day week that's why it feels like that um anyways i wanted to give you guys an update on my hair um i just slept on it so it looks a little bit crazy but the hair mask did wonders to my hair like it feels so smooth and just so much healthier than ever before like i just can't stop touching my hair which is bad um but like it just feels so much better i cannot even express that to you guys enough so i'll have that link down below anyways i'm about to go and run um i'm doing an ig live with daylight later of a pilates class so i need to do the run now so i can calm down in between um and i'm recording with whitney port for the podcast today and all that stuff so i'm really excited propeller hat again guys okay oh you were up on the frame so we're just gonna hope for the best um i'm really tired i just made a latte i got back from my run it was so great i'm so glad i woke up and did that Oh my gosh, guys. Um, my new thing is that I'm just going to make myself wake up at 7.30 every morning. The fact that I used to regularly wake up between, like, the hours of 5 and 6.30 is appalling to me, guys. Like, I don't know how I was waking up that early. Waking up at 7.30 is, like, difficult. I don't get it. So, anyways, I'm going to go do my Devo, my quiet time. I've been really bad about it this week, and I normally don't miss like I've been missing. So, I need to go do that. And I always feel so much better when I do it. Um... Guys, I feel like I look like such a college girl, like workout college girl, you know? I mean, technically I am a college girl, but you know what I mean? Okay, guys, I don't like my office the way it's set up now. I mean, it's not even done. These are just random things in here, honestly, but I have a new vision. I actually might paint this black. I haven't decided. I kind of want a black wall um, with like, I don't know. I have some ideas. I just don't know, but since this room is so small, it might just make this feel so small. I think I might turn that chair into my desk chair getting rid of this rug i'm getting a cowhide rug because this is shape is just so weird blah 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 um and that works best and i'm gonna move this desk in the middle so you guys will see and we'll figure it out maybe i'll keep that chair thing is i just love this chair and i feel like i don't really have room for it unless i keep it up here so that's the problem that we're currently facing and i spent a lot of money on this chair and I really love it. So I don't want to go without it. So we'll figure it out. I have just like random mess and stuff. But I'm going to just quickly move some stuff. So I ended up, I'll show you guys. Ignore that. That's literally battery stains from that horrific day I had a few months ago. Um, my laundry is still sitting there. I ended up moving the rug there. I don't know how I feel about it exactly. We'll see. It needs to be straightened out and stuff with my dad. So I need him to come over and help me today. <sighs> this is like not even on my agenda for this morning, but here we are. Um, I found a rug that I really like. This is obviously gonna have to get onto the den. I'm just gonna have to make it work. I love this chair, but it just, it's gonna have to move, which is unfortunate. I don't know, like, I don't know. I, I need a shelving thing probably, but I don't really wanna do it behind. I want this to just be prints. We'll see what ends up happening. But you guys ask all the time like where this case is from. Um, it's from Cover Lab. I thought this was gonna be more of a light pink and it's definitely showing more purple, but hopefully it will just fade. And then I have a new phone case. I've had this phone case on for forever. So I might switch those out. And then I'm also gonna have my cute little AirPods case, which I'm so excited for. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I saw Lauren have these from the Daily Edit and then I realized that Cover Lab had them way cheaper. Or daily edited which one is it? i don't know but so cute 
I love the daily edit, daily edited, whatever I will say though, that my cover lock cases have held up better than my daily edited and these are so cheap. I got two custom phone cases for like $50, which is really good when it's like custom. So here we go. Okay, I just FaceTime Dom forever. Like, uh, it's just incredible what... If you guys don't know, I already mentioned this in this vlog, but the um, posts that are like going viral and stuff um, are Dom's. And it's not that like, we're like, oh my gosh, you're going viral, haha. -ha. It's just like, for obviously like such a good purpose. And it's more so than anything, I think we're just more like encouraged at like the power of a voice. And I think that's a crazy, what is crazy, like Dua Lipa just reposted it. And we're like, it, and it's not like who, obviously like we love Dua Lipa, but it's it's not like who's reposting it it's just the fact that like dom just had something to say and said it and it's like gone this far and i feel like it's you know it's such a good and it's like making change and it's really incredible so it was really cool um daylight and i are going on live soon i'm so tired and i don't know why it's 11 26 um we're gonna go on live in like 20 minutes okay the workout has officially been saved to my ig tv here we go, if you guys wanna watch it. We actually wanna do a group Zoom. I just showered and got ready so quick. I'm at first on me because I need to take it into my office. It's a really far commute, guys. I put on like a very slight bit of makeup and I'm about to go record with Whitney Port for the podcast. I also have mascara under my eyes as literally always, guys. So annoying. Here we go. I need my cute AirPods. Love these. My Hydro Flask. Okay, so Whitney and I just recorded. I literally love her. We had the best time. Um, it was so great. So, anyways, that episode will be up soon. My eyes are watering. I don't know why. It's actually I do. It's because I got my moisturizer too close to my eyes. But yeah, I just have computer work that I need to do for the rest of the day and just random stuff around the house. It's almost the weekend. Um, I'm so excited. Guys, we have exciting new additions to the room. I got lamps. Honestly, they've changed the game. They're incredible. That one's messed up. I have to fix it. Um, and then these are my sham inserts. So anyways, I ordered them from Parachute Home. So, okay, yeah, you're already there. So those will be coming in hopefully soon. And then I'll have shams there and it'll look so much better. But it's really coming along. Okay, guys, the rug has arrived. I'm going to try my best to set it up myself. This is just a really large rug. Also, definitely looks like a totally different color, which I forgot. No, I didn't. All right, guys, I did the rug. I actually like it, so it's fine. I'm just worried for when I need to bring my chair down and just trying to make that work. I'm gonna have to make it work because I love that chair, but it's definitely looking better. My projector stand comes Sunday. I need to fluff up the couch, but I like the rug. It's super soft and this is just such a cozy vibe. Okay guys, we have a fun little purchase. I got these little, I got these little glass espresso cups when I just want to take a shot of espresso, which I think I'm actually gonna start doing, um, especially with my like Nespresso, but I just thought this was super cute and it mashed kind of my mugs already. Got another razor. I'm gonna eat lunch that so I just heated up. Okay, I have my lunch. I'm gonna finish editing and just getting some work done from the den. Really excited for what I'm gonna do with the office, guys. I just keep going with ho like house stuff at this point. Like what else is there to do? But hope you guys enjoyed this week's vlog. I love you guys so much and I will see you soon. Bye.